Hey, you know, the one thing about any sport, it's almost a year-round situation, but when you're in a smaller community, you guys play so many multiple sports. How do you kind of juggle all that and then get ready for another season? Um, I mean, you just kind of have to work hard at everything you do. So I think it's important to focus on what you're doing at the time you're doing it, but you also have to be strong and, I don't know, yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. Hey, by the way, go back to last year, if you don't mind, and kind of take me through it. It ended up not being at the end of the year the way you wanted it to be. You were so close, though, to making that ultimate step to the next level. But what did that teach you from a year ago? Um, I think it taught us that everything isn't everything doesn't go the way you think it will and um, it just I think it's a great learning experience is that something that you anticipate you guys will be able to feed off this year and use it somewhere out throughout the season yes I believe so I believe that we'll use it as fuel to help us in the future you guys offensively were very explosive but now your quarterback has moved on and and that's one area I'm sure that you can look at and say how do we replace that what have you seen so far in camp from that position um, well, both of our, we have two sophomore quarterbacks, and they're both looking very good. And I think it's going to be a battle between the both of them. But I think whoever comes out on top will be okay. Hey, by the way, you guys are the team now. Everybody looks at and says, "Okay, we got to beat Hagerstown." And you guys have had this tradition that's been on an upswing for several years. Talk a little bit about what it means to be that team with the target on your back. Um, I mean, I think that the success we've had, I think, is very nice, and I think we owe it all to the coaches and our hard work all together in general. But I don't think Coach Snodgrass would be probably be the first one to tell you last year's fine, but it doesn't matter now because most people say that's last year. Do you guys kind of get that sense too? Yeah, we get that sense. Like we want we want it to be a different year, a different legacy, I guess.